Daddy Wants to Fit In by Jackie Lomenzo Illustrated by Eddie Martinez In my colony, I don't fit in. Ants eat everything, right? Not me. I only like pizza, peanut butter sandwiches, and pasta with butter. Sauce is yucky. Tonight, just like most nights, I don't like what my family is having for dinner. Instead of eating what they are having, I make myself a peanut butter sandwich. My brothers poke me and tease me for not eating what they're eating. Mealtime is not my favorite. I don't fit in. What if we celebrate every time you try something new? Suggests Dad. A celebration? Just for me? Okay, I exclaim. What about this carrot? Asks Mom. I sniff the carrot and stand tall so everyone can see me. Mom takes out her camera to snap a picture of this exciting moment. I freeze. What if I hate it? What if I like it? Then everyone will say, I told you so. My antennae starts to tingle, warning me of danger. My belly says no. Everyone is disappointed. Maybe a celebration is not such a good idea. Tonight, we dine with the colony. Platters of peas, pork, and potatoes are passed around. The other ants watch me, waiting to see what I'll eat. My friends poke me and tease me for not eating what they're eating. Meal time is not my favorite. I don't fit in. My friends double dare me to try a pea. Just one, they scream excitedly. Everybody is staring at me. It makes me nervous. My antennae start to tingle and my belly shouts no. They all laugh at me while they shovel spoonfuls of peas into their mouths. I want to find a quiet tunnel and curl up by myself. The next morning, everyone is feasting on blueberries. Have I mentioned that mealtime is not my favorite? No, thank you, I say politely. Dad blurts out, Eddie, I'll give you ten dollars if you try this blueberry. Ten dollars? Then I could finally buy the shoes I've been saving up for. But if he's giving me that much money to eat it, it must be yucky. I pass on the ten dollars. Tonight, we're going to do something a little different, Mom announces. Everyone will bring something they like to dinner and we will all share. I march off, knowing that everyone will laugh at whatever I bring. Another peanut butter sandwich, they'll say, rolling their eyes. After walking for a while, I come across a cornfield. Would I like corn, I wonder? I peel down the green leaf, revealing shiny yellow beads of corn. I sniff. My antennae start to tingle. That's my usual warning sign to run away. But the tingling does not feel so scary when I'm by myself. Maybe I could taste it. Nobody is here to laugh at me if I make a face or spit it out. I take a deep breath, 
and nibble the corn. Hmm, I take another bite. I can't help but smile. I know exactly what to bring to dinner tonight. Giggling with pride, I gather enough corn for everybody to share. Tonight, nobody says anything about me eating something different because for the first time, we are all eating the same thing. Delicious, sweet, crunchy corn. And I fit right in. <laughs>